Hi everyone and welcome to codingzest.com. Guys, in this video, I will show you how you can get image from your external storage in your Android application. So let's get started. And as you can see here, I have already created a new Android project. And if I show you my XML file, so here I have one image view and one button. So from this button, we will open our external storage. And uh, when we get the image, so we will set the image to this image view. Okay. And I'm using uh, view binding in this uh, tutorial. So if you don't know how to use view binding or uh, what is view binding, so you can ask me in the comment section. I will uh, record a separate video for uh, view binding in Android okay so first of all uh, we need to go to the manifest and here we will add the permission so use permission and we will uh, add the read external storage permission okay and now we will close the manifest and uh, here we will use the activity result launcher which is the replacement of uh, start activity for result and as we all know uh, start activity for result is deprecated so we can use the activity result launcher so simply type activity result launcher and it will be the type of intent okay and uh, i will name it uh, okay uh, let me import the intent class here so simply alt enter and import it okay i will name it uh, image uh, image launcher simply image launcher you can name it uh, anything you want or uh, image result launcher okay so image result launcher okay result launcher and uh, here i need to create two method uh, one for uh, private void so i will name it pick image pick image from gallery okay in this method we will uh, we will create our intent to the gallery so simply type intent and i will name it gallery intent okay it will be equal to a uh, new intent and here we will pass the intent uh, action pick we are picking the image from gallery so intent dot action underscore pick okay so pick and here we will uh, set the type so what we are getting here we are getting images so simply type gallery and then dot set type and simply in the column simply type images i think no image forward slash steric so all the images in our external storage and here we will uh, launch our result but first of all we need to uh, register it but let me launch it and uh, i will pass the gallery intent okay so uh, first of all i will create another method for launching the result so private void uh, sorry register uh, image launch uh, image result launcher you can name it anything you want but i am giving it a name which is readable okay so when someone read this code so uh, he should know that this this method is for this purpose okay so here what we will do we will type image result launcher it will be equal to register uh, for activity result and inside this what we will do we will type activity uh, activity result contracts that start activity for result okay and uh, here we will add the callback and inside the callback uh, as you can see here we uh, we are getting our results so i will simply add a try catch and the result okay so in this i will create a yuri for image so this will be the image yuri image yuri is equal to result dot get data two time get data get data dot get data okay so it will get the image yuri from here and i am using the binding so when binding dot iv image dot set set image yuri I will set the image URI, URI here okay and I will also add the cache block here exception and I will just simply type the exception here and I will also add a toast here uh, before uh, after this 
so when the user uh, doesn't select any image so we will show the toast no image selected no image is selected so this is our exception handling okay so now uh, we will go for the runtime permission from the user so i will just create a new method private void and i will name it check um, storage storage permission and get image okay so i will uh, i will check if the result is not granted so it if activity activity dot combat check self permission and I will pass this activity name main dot this and below here I will uh, type manifest permission dot read external storage and if it is not equal to package manager package package manager okay here it is where is the package manager this is the package manager uh, permission granted if it is not granted then uh, we will we will request the permission and if it is granted so we will uh, call this intent okay so if it is not granted what we will do we will uh, simply type activity compared dot uh, request permission so main activity dot this okay and below here new string array and this array we can uh, we can also pass uh, multiple permission but here we need only read external storage permission so i will just simply type manifest dot permission dot uh, read external storage okay and uh, here is some issue and what is the issue we need a code so let me uh, create a variable for the code so private uh, static final and integer and it will be the storage storage sorry storage permission code and it will be equal to one you can uh, assign any value to this code variable and you can also pass something like this but i will i will recommend you to use the variable so storage permission code and because we need this storage permission code in um, upcoming uh, method okay so uh, if the permission is not granted we will request the runtime permission and if it is granted so in the else section what we will do we will uh, we will uh, call the we will call the pick image and then here okay so now this uh, method is completed and uh, below here we will override a method which is on request permission result okay so first of all we will check for the code if request code is equal to storage permission code then we will move ahead okay so now we will check if grant result dot length greater than zero so it means the permission is granted and we will add a end grant result uh, square bracket uh, zero which is the index for the permission and as you can see here we are only passing one permission in the array so this permission will be on the zero index and we will check for a uh, package manager dot permission granted so here we will check if the permission is granted so simply call the intent here and in the else we will show a toast to the user okay so what will be the toast the toast will be something like uh, storage permission is is denied okay so please allow allow permission to get image okay you can uh, type anything you want in this message section okay so on the on our button click what we will do first of all let me uh, register this so register launcher and on the button click i will uh, call the check permission method okay so uh, if the permission is granted so we will open the external storage now i will run this application and you can also find the source code link in the description so let me run this application 
okay guys so this is our application and now i will click on this get image from gallery and it will ask for the permission allow get image from gallery so this is our application name uh, to access photos and media on your device and if i click on don't allow so it will show a toast storage permission is denied please allow permission to get image now i will click again on this button and i will allow the permission and it will open up your our uh, external storage okay so what I will do uh, if I go to the screenshot and as you can see here this is a screenshots in my external storage and if I select this one so this is set to this image view and if I go back and now uh, if I uh, if I didn't select any image here and if I go back so it will show it was no image selected so if we won't uh, handle this exception here so it will crash your application so make sure you handle the exception very well in your application okay and if i want to change the image so i will go to the camera and i uh, will select this one so okay uh, why? okay so that's it this is how you can uh, get images from your external storage and set it to your image view. So that's it for this video guys and if you like this video please share this video with your friends and also make sure you are subscribed to my channel and the bell notification option is on so you won't miss the upcoming videos.